Okay, take two of filming this video because the first time I was out of focus. Love life. <laughs> Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be telling you guys what I wish I knew before my freshman year of college. If you guys didn't already know, I am entering my second year of college in September and I am so, so excited. During my first year of college, I definitely learned so, so much and now I feel like I've got the vibe down and I'm ready to tackle on my second year of college. And if you guys are new here on my channel, hi, my name is Leilani. I upload a new video every Wednesday and Saturday. So make sure you click that subscribe button down below and turn on that post notification bell. Let's just hop into the video. So I believe that the easiest way to make friends is to go out to eat or plan study dates with people within your class. I feel like this is such an easy way to make friends because when you go out to eat, you're obviously talking with the other person so you get to really bond and connect with them. And this is literally how I met my best friends in college. We just decided to go out to lunch together after our psychology class ended. And then after that, we started having lunch together every single day. And try to talk to your neighbors, like whoever is sitting around you because like during your 10 minute break, like in between classes, you just have a specific amount of time to like chill and hang out. So you can use those 10 minutes to talk with others and make new friends. Next, you should not be afraid to do stuff on your own. In college, you are becoming very independent. You don't have your parents or your old friends from high school with you all the time. You're basically doing everything on your own. So don't be afraid to go out to lunch by yourself or just study in the library by yourself. Like you don't have to attach yourself to the hip of another person. Don't be afraid to do stuff on your own. My next tip is to join tons of clubs. This way you are constantly doing something and you have something to look forward to every single week since clubs do tend to meet either weekly or like a few times a month. And also this is another way to make new friends because if you're joining a club, you obviously have a similar interest with another person. Like for example, I'm in a club where everyone in the club are education majors, so I know that no matter who I talk to, I know that the other person's gonna have something in common with me, and that's just like the beginning of friendships right there. Since I know coffee is the best friends of many college students, try to buy your own iced coffee or like the cake cups for your Keurig outside of campus. Like try to buy at like the supermarket or something. You don't have to spend money on Starbucks or Dunkin', whatever coffee places on campus because that eats away your money so, so fast. Like during my freshman year of college, I would probably go to Starbucks every single morning, which is so, so bad, but I mean, I needed coffee. Like I could not go a day without coffee and I would just be so tired. I finally found a iced coffee company that I really like. So I'm going to be purchasing that every single week and I'm paying only three bucks for a big thing of iced coffee and it's gonna last me the entire week. Next, you should always stay on top of your homework and keep your priorities in check. So for example, if your friends ask like, hey, wanna go out to lunch with me today or wanna go out tonight to wherever, like think in the back of your mind, okay, do I have a homework assignment that's due tomorrow or in the next couple days? If so, I should really focus on that instead of hanging out with my friends because you have the next four years of college to do whatever and make tons and tons of memories. So always try to finish your homework up before hanging out with friends so then you're not slacking. This next tip is so, so important. I cannot stress this tip enough and it is to be sure to give yourself some me time this correlates with like mental health. You don't want to stress yourself out and you don't want to keep piling loads and loads of homework on top of you because you're just going to drown in homework and it's not going to be fun and you're going to be crying because you just want to relax but you can't because you have all this homework. So make sure you give yourself like 15 minute breaks in between doing homework assignments or give yourself a 30 minute nap after your classes are finished. So then you could just de-stress and relax. Just keep yourself motivated, keep yourself going for it and doing all of your homework right away because then you won't have all of the stress on you when the due dates are coming up for certain things. And last but not least, you should always try to budget your money. 
I know in college it's a little hard because of course you want to make memories with your friends so you're always accepting invitations to go out to eat with friends or do whatever with your friends so just try to budget your money like try not to spend too much a lot of college kids they'll be bored so they'll go online and they'll find a lot of cute clothes aka me and then you'll just spend all of your money and then it goes away and you're like oh my gosh i don't have money for food or coffee or life you literally run out of money so so fast so Try to like put a percentage of your check away if you do have an on-campus or off-campus job. That's what I am trying to do for this upcoming year. Like always have extra spending money on the side just in case if something does come up where I'm like, okay, I do need money, but I don't want to like touch my gas money or my food money. So always make sure that you have extra cash with you. So that is it with this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you give it a thumbs up and comment down below any other questions that you may have for me about college or just school. And then also comment down below any video requests that you have for me for the back to school season. So that is it and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!